To end this tutorial, we would like to leave you with some tips and pointers. As we mentioned in the introduction, we purposely employed a very specific editing method when creating this tutorial. For example, we inserted clips via the player window. This method, which may seem complicated to start with, has the advantage that subsequent steps, such as setting in and out points, mapping definitions, or using insert and overwrite, are made easier. With this method, you learn the basic functions of EDIUS more thoroughly. Of course, there are other ways of working with EDIUS, but they were outside the scope of this tutorial. Using drag and drop to put clips on the timeline, for example. Fundamentally, though, the same basic rules apply. For users who want to delve deeper, there will be further EDIUS 6 tutorials from the creators of this tutorial. Visit www.onscreentraining.com for further details. And of course, we look forward to hearing your feedback concerning this and other tutorials.